What's up, my honey pot? Um, we're just hanging out with the dog. We're gonna take her for a little walk today. Um, I'll show you around. I figure like today's kind of a good first day vlog. Um, I'll figure out how to like edit everything. Hopefully things go well. And then maybe I can do some like more fun and crazy vlogs in the future. But for this one, it's, I'm feeling pretty like low energy today, which, you know, um, is a part of life. I'm just feeling a little, a little tired. So we'll see how things go. Um, I'm really excited to show you this park. It's super smoky. Um, there's nobody here because nobody knows about it. It's one of my like go-to spots actually. Uh, I used to come here all the time when I went to community college. It was like not even like 15 minute drive maybe and then I would come smoke weed and I would go for a walk and then I would go back to class and probably smell pretty dang to be honest but um I think it's a fun park and uh you know I just want to show you a little a little insights outside of my like crazy crazy life um sometimes I do like you know normal boring things like go for walks <laughs> you know <laughs> so um yeah let's get started all right, so I'm out of the car. We're walking over. I'm wearing my iconic Budweiser shirt. <laughs> Shout out to Lana Del Rey, iconic stand. Anyway, <laughs> so um, yeah, this place is like really amazing. It's one of my like favorite spots just because it was like super close. And this is honestly like the place I really fell in love with, like California, and just hiking and the hills like um i feel like a lot of people don't know but i honestly spend like a lot of time like by myself just hiking um it's like one of my passions so uh, it's kind of fun i get to be like oh come along hiking with me and hopefully there'll be some good views um as you can see it's like super fucking um cloudy well it's not cloudy it's technically smoky because of all the california forest fires holy shit that is so devastating to me. Some of these places are like, you know, hundreds, thousands of years old and just like that burned away. But, you know, I don't know. I'm trying to make it kind of positive when things burn away so that they can make room for new things. Hopefully we kind of get on top of this global warming shit. And then <laughs> and there's not all this, like, I just can't imagine, that, like, every year it gets worse. I can't imagine next year. It's going to, like, literally all of California, it's just going to fucking burn. Oh, my God, it stresses me out so much. But <laughs> anyway, <laughs> back to this beautiful trail. <laughs> Fucking hell. Um, yeah. Uh, I'll like, sh hopefully, okay, that was what I was gonna say. This place has an amazing, amazing view. Um, it takes you over, uh, the Tracy, like, um, pass. It's got like, I don't know what they're called. They're like the, oh, big windmills, duh. But they're like, <laughs> the like, like, like really, <laughs> I didn't say this vlog was gonna be fucking good, okay? I just said I was gonna make it. Um, but it takes you over on top of this like overpass look. Maggie! Come on! It takes you over this overpass and hopefully we'll be able to like see something and it's not too smoky today. But I can't make any promises. I have lost my dog, so I'm going to sign off and find her. <laughs> good news, I found my dog. Say hi, Maggie. Can you say hi? She's like, no, I'm tired now. <laughs> We've only gone like five minutes. Okay, so as you can see, we're starting to get a little bit of elevation, slowly but surely. Um, and you can see all these hills with their dead, dead grass. <laughs> and that's why they keep burning up like crazy, crazy, crazy. Um, it's because of all this stuff. And we have like a nice little breeze out here and it just carries all the fire. Yeah. Alright, Maggie and I are just hanging out, taking a little water break, and um, I was thinking, like, I used to come here, like, literally a year ago, and it was probably maybe, like, closer to two, but I feel like it was, like, like, realistically, like, it feels like two years, you know what I mean, but it was probably one, um, and I, like, so much has changed, like, since I was coming here, like, you know, just, like, me as a person. I remember, like, the reason, um, I, like, started actually, like, picking up, like, hiking was just because I was, like, so unhappy and miserable, like, in myself. Like, I had such bad anxiety that I would hang out with, like, literally everybody and I'd be like, oh my god, they hate me. I can't do anything right to, like, anything I say. And so, like, since then, I was like, you know, I really gotta fix that. I gotta be more comfortable as, like, you know as myself, obviously, like, duh, <laughs> and so 
I like um I've definitely done that like looking back on like a year checkpoint and like that's all I could really ask for is like oh I've grown like so much as a person and you know a lot of that like people complain about like anxiety and you know how they're like stressed out and how they're unhappy but like a lot of like facing that is just like enduring uncomfortable situations like for me it was just like I had to do a, like a lot of random chaotic stuff and just realize that like at the end of the day no matter like what I do whatever dumb shit I like get my myself into I always get myself out of and like that's like really important because now it's like oh I'm like confident about like 90% of situations because I'm like oh I've done that already if not worse <laughs> I made that a girl she's like it's hot don't touch me oh can I get a kiss mm, thank you thank you my beautiful babies oh <laughs> she's so cute she i look at her face and she just makes me so fucking happy and one day i was in like traffic and she's just like doing her thing and um this lady like sees her and she like legit rolls down her window and i rolled down my window and she's like your dog is smiling at me and i was like oh yeah she does that she loves you and she's like i love your dog and we had like a like moment i was like oh oh <laughs> i was so stupid <laughs> how pretty this is i think it like probably is just a, li a little bit nostalgic but like i don't know there's something just really magnificent about like these hills they just like do something really dirty to me i don't know what but i don't know if it's like all the textures because you can kind of like see like the different layers of like hills and then these like little trees are so like shrubbery i don't know it's really cute but <laughs> uh, let me show you we're gonna walk so we're gonna walk this way and then go up here and around and then down here and there's also like this little path that like goes back to the parking lot that has um like kind of a lake down there i don't know if you can see it but yeah there's like a little lake so we could have gone that way but i like this way a little bit better and then they both meet up here it doesn't really matter which way you go you end up in the same spot and then i'm gonna go up this way and around this ridge and there's this really pretty view spot of all the hills and these windmill boys. Um, yeah, cool. This looks like a scene that Kanye West would spend money to see. He would like go out here and be like, oh yeah, so futuristic, so minimalistic. <laughs> We live in a futuristic world. It's 2020. The water has taken over all of this landscape. We're forced to become pirates. What a world we live in. We have to grow gills. <laughs> this is just an excuse. Uh, where is it? To show off my chesty ass. <laughs> in the best angle possible. I'm sure I can't even see what I'm doing. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Look at that. Dusty, no ass. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Ew, ew. Static, static. Oh, I gotta keep it this way because it's YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> the shirt is so cool. Let's be honest. Sorry. Um, the king of the butts. I love this shirt. Hilarious. <laughs> I always get compliments when I wear it. I mean, I always wear it to like sleazy places that they would like this, <laughs> but you know. You gotta know who you're marketing to. <laughs> butts. <laughs> Speaking of butts. <laughs> yeah, this is supposed to be like the best view. Normally you can see like all the way back here, but it's okay. It looks kind of haunted and a little spooky. I feel like this is also the time I want to show off my tattoo and my dusty sneakers and my mismatched socks. Heyo, shout out to that. Um, but look at this. I hand poked both of my ankles myself. I like literally sat like this and I just like poked away at them. Everybody always asks me. They're like, oh, Milk and Honey, like the poetry book? And I'm like, no. And then it's funny because this one's actually from a poem, but like nobody ever asked me if that one's from a poem. <laughs> and I'm like, but I was telling the same thing. I'm like, they both represent paradise and the Bible. And they're always like, oh. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'm not a weirdo, I swear. And then look, I also have this little crow boy. Um, I got him on, oops, sorry. I got him Friday the 13th on a full moon and he felt super spooky. He's got a little like skull head. 
um i think he's cute i like him i also have like two big lovebirds on the back they're like my favorite and then a little kitsune okay so this is like totally chaotic but i was peeling this orange and i was thinking about how much like nutrition i think that the peel has and i was like hmm i wonder if i could just bite into it and like if that would be good for me or not and then i remembered that like one time i was like walking down the street and i had like i bought like way too many oranges at the store and i was giving one of them to like this homeless guy and i give it to him and i'm like hey do you like want an orange and he's like okay and he takes it from me and then he just like <sighs> like oh my god so i don't know about that <laughs> but that just reminded me it said no purpose that was it okay peace out <laughs> this you know how i said it's like a kanye west like music video or some shit out here like look at this you know, like sheep just hanging out and then these like windmills oh my god so it's aesthetic like <laughs> this is hilarious <laughs> oh my god my dog is like <laughs> Let's see, can we navigate this situation? Whoa, look at all those sheep go! Look at all those sheep go! God, there's that dog. Oh shit. Oh my god, now we're gonna get barked off, are we? Oh shit. Are you guys gonna play or are we gonna get eaten? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Hey buddy, how's it going? Are you a nice dog or are you a mean dog? Put it on you. <laughs> You're so sweet. 
Spazzy! So spazzy. Look at that! You look a little fuck. This dog is smiling right now too. He's all happy. <laughs> oh my god, there's another dog! Oh no! Hi dog! Are you guys both friendly? You look all smiley now. Yeah, he's like, oh my god! Two dogs! Hey you! Like, nice moment. Thank you for saving my life, Mr. Dog. I almost just like kept walking and then I looked back and I was like, dang, they herded all the sheep onto that like main trail. And then I was like, holy fuck, I'm about to miss the main trail. Cause I was just gonna keep walking that way. So, you know, shows if you're nice to your friends, they're nice to you too. <laughs> this is some Bob Ross shit. Hello, let's smoke weed and talk about some gay shit. <laughs> I think the lesson here today is that even if you don't feel super happy or super great or just like, you know, whatever, you can still have a good day and you can still have an adventure and something kind of mundane and boring. You just got to make sure you have the right attitude. Okay, so thanks for coming along. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. This was kind of a lot of fun to make, honestly, so I'll probably make more. Um, but until then, yeah, hopefully, you know, subscribe like whatever <laughs> the, the, the youtube shit is um, this is my dog she's also very tired <laughs> we had a nice long walk come baby girls so we're gonna go head back home have a good rest of your day see ya see ya